hello everyone how you all doing here is my collection of everything you need to know about ios 15 so let's go without wasting more time so first of all after updating my device this is the screen that i got you can see there is a new look the notification looks really really good not gonna lie then we have do not disturb thing here and after updating the iphone the first thing that i noticed was do not disturb and a little bit of a tweaked control center if you see here the control center is tweaked and uh, if you long press on here you can access all these controls and everything in general till now feels really damn amazing on this update and to be honest i'm already in love with this update then another thing is the camera text copy thing in my opinion i don't really know what it is but it is really dope i saw it in the keynote and now i tried it you can see here is my attacks box and I, and it did work really well not gonna lie you can see it worked really well i just pointed it towards the air tag box and it did work really quickly and uh, i'm surprised how good it worked or considering it's a beta one of a beta one update then another thing is after going into settings the iphone storage if i'll talk about it have took over 11 gigabytes of other storage i mean that's really a lot my iphone is a 64 gig iphone but still i have a lot of storage left because uh, apparently my iphone i don't really use iphone to store a lot of stuff photos and all that much so that's the reason that i got a 64 gig iphone 12 and uh, if i'll talk about the update size the update size was 5.55 almost 6 gigabytes to be exact 5.45 gb and now you can also double tap on images like this and copy the text and it's pretty neat feature not gonna lie then another thing is vpn and management page is tweaked a little bit and as you can see here those rounded corners and all i really like this that how apple is going towards the mac os type is look you know and we can also we have this new thing which is sign in to work or school account which is really dope and neat feature i will use it i have my school account and i will use it on my iphone and let you guys know how it is going on well till now on my iphone 12 i'm really enjoying this update i will keep updating you guys really soon on my channel so consider subscribing to the channel and help us reach the 10k milestone goal that i have for this year another thing is after opening the mail you guys will get this mail privacy protection thing here we have two options that we have to select protect mail activity don't protect mail activity as you can see apple is going towards their own thing you know uh, giving users options right obviously you gotta click on protect mail activity what it will do is it will hide your ip address and uh, for more information you can watch the keynote they explained it really well i have link in the description another thing is while accessing location you will have this new location navigation logo and uh, this looks really neat and really well done not gonna lie i don't know why apple did not showcase a lot of things that is new in this update but yeah whatever we, i i think they actually thought that youtubers will cover it so yeah there is that then another thing is on battery settings and pretty much all settings you can see here as we have this spaces if i'll open it in front of you guys right now you can see that here we have a lot of spaces and in my opinion this type of ui this looks really damn neat until now my iphone feels really fluid and really amazing i'm doing i'm updating on my iphone 7 too so if you are interested into that video on my iphone 10 or 11 consider subscribing to the channel and another thing is when you will open iMessage you will get this this screen and it says that shared with you content shared in iMessage can automatically appear in apps such as music photo safari and more like we all know about it right and we can edit the settings too by clicking here 
and uh, there is this like there there are two new splash screens that i have came across till now talking about the maps if you can see here you can see here looking for traffic this is a new thing which is introduced on ios 15 well apple did not talk about it and uh, to be honest maps now feels really damn amazing after this update another thing is the new city logo so if you will see here this is the new city logo and here you will see the old city logo hopefully i will add but uh, come on look at the time it's like so late and i am making a video so uh, yeah there is this logo and uh, it is the new logo so this is what is changed in this update another thing is magnifier app after updating my iphone i did got this magnifier app which which do have a little bit of a new thing like if you will see here this magnifier app is a uh, is little bit better compared to earlier the settings feels refreshed and everything the app in general feels really good and refreshed after this update then another thing is focus opening the settings and then going here we have this focus and as you can see do not disturb sleep personal work share across all devices i will turn this feature on because this is really neat feature and uh, as you all know i review every single device on every beta version so i have to turn this feature on and it is really neat feature it is basically if you guys follow that pomodoro thing it will help you achieve that then another thing is notifications so notification now is finally it is the thing right finally apple thank you so much after after asking for it hundreds thousands of times finally we have great notifications like this group notifications are now just amazing i really love this group de notifications uh, that's pretty much it for today's video if this video was helpful for you all consider subscribing to the channel because i am making by the time you are watching this video i am already making a bunch three four of more videos which are exporting right now peace out and i will meet you all in the very next episode